Will the defendants rise? Considering all the facts and arguments presented by both counsel, and after careful deliberation, I find the defendants guilty as charged. They haven't been a treat myself, but what do you do? I mean, um, sulking and, you know, it is what it is. Uh, you know, if you just pray it gets better, you know, sometimes it does for a little bit and sometimes it doesn't. I feel like I've been in this nightmare for three freaking years. So I've just learned to, to deal with it and just pray for a better tomorrow and just pray that people will get some some you know humanity back in their bones and quit being so nasty mean and evil you know i don't think that'll ever happen i don't think that they understand they're so they're so there's just something not right i mean it, it just it just isn't um then you're, you're never going to fix that you know that's not a fixable problem it's 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 an issue with the person not you so i just um you know some days are better than others even for me but we just you just make through make do that's what you do put your put your boots on and you just get to step in you know what do you do when you have a problem you go over it under it or around it you know, don't want to let anybody stop you. When somebody tells you they're going to stop you, you know, stick, give them a middle finger and say, F you, move out of the way. <laughs> right? I mean, that's kind of what I'm trying to do with uh, communist Sumner County, but we'll see how, how it all works. You know, I'm going to go there the 20th. I swear to God, if, if these people think that hashtags and threatening to sue is some type of direct or indirect threat to somebody's freaking life, they, they, they're, I, I don't even, I don't trust them anymore. I really don't care. I think this whole thing is a freaking joke. Um, I think that uh, they're just pushing to push. Uh, they're trying to shut me up and they, they, they're they upset that they can't lawfully and legally. So the only way they're going to shut me up is by violating my rights and they're happy to do so. I think it's disgusting, quite frankly. I think it's absolutely disgusting and appalling. But I, I'm going to force them to do what they want to do. And when they do, they can deal with the repercussions of it. But trust me, they can only throw me away for so long, okay? And I can guarantee you, if that's what they choose to do, it's what they choose to do. There's nothing that I'm going to say or not say that's going to stop them. That judge already had his mind made up to violate my rights um, last month. And he most likely has, has his mind made up to violate my rights uh, on the 20th. I, I don't know which. I can tell you, I don't, I, I don't care. I mean, I'm not going to live in, in, in constant fear because a judge in a, in, in a, in a police department want to put me in constant fear. Fuck them. Fuck them. Clip that. Clip that. Clip that. I have a right to be here. And I'm going to continue to do my thing. Protected by the Constitution. And I absolutely know 100%. I absolutely know 100%. with that judge and that judge doesn't have to like me but what we will do is we will go over him under him or around him if he wants to keep violating life rights it is what it is so i it, it frustrates me i don't trust him and i don't he can sit there and judge me all day long if i don't care for if i don't really have respect for somebody their judgment upon me ain't nothing you know it just isn't i don't like them i don't care for them i think their county is corrupt as hell i think that they have some major problems and I'm going to make them do what they want to do. They want to shut me up. The only way you're going to shut me up about a public interest case is violating my First Amendment rights and throwing me in jail. And if that's what the judge wants to be known for, God bless him. But he will deal with the repercussions of his actions at some point. You know, I'm fine. I will be fine. Do I want to go to jail? Of course not. Will I go to jail? You're damn right. you damn right. I'll do my freaking time gracefully. Gracefully. And you know what? It's an honor to go to jail fighting for a 15-year-old boy against a corrupt system that wants to kowtow to people that probably disappeared him. Not my problem. Not my problem. But, um... Like she's just chewing me a new you-know-what. And I, so I, I'm looking, Glenn, Glenn heard it, like she's yelling at me so loud that uh, Glenn's trying to get out and see Park can, uh, you know, drop me off here. And he's getting out and I said, see? And she come, she come out and, and, and so he's putting Emily out and she's still yelling at me as I'm trying to walk her over to Emily. She's still there. And he's like, well, damn, I said, I told you. And then whenever I got there, all she wanted to do was be in my lap. She didn't want, want to let me out of her sight. And I'm like, ah! No, no. <laughs> she likes stinky stuff. I get it. <sighs> she likes stinky stuff. I get it. I get it.
the defendants rise? No offense to my friend. Considering all the facts and arguments presented by both counsel, and after careful deliberation, I find the defendants guilty as charged.